Hey, what is up everyone? This is Ari Reviews. In this video, I will show you the top 50 free CD tweaks that are compatible with iOS 9.2 up to 9.3.3. Face down. This tweak allows to easily lock your device simply by putting it face down like this. And as you can see, the device is locked. App color close. When you want to delete an app, this tweak will colorize the X button based on the color of the icon of the app that you want to delete. Last app is a tweak which allows it to move between your two recently used apps and to do that you need to go to activator and just select a gesture and then select last app. So I have chosen here the double tap on the status bar. You can see when I double tap on the status bar it will take me to the calculator then back to the notes, back to the calculator, pretty awesome tweak. Grabber time is a very useful tweak where you're on full screen mode and you can just slide here the grabber of the notification center and you will see the time right there. Carrot, a very useful tweak which will add two extra buttons on the control center of your device. So you will have a repeat button and also a shuffle button which are very useful. CC color, you can use this tweak to change the color of your control center to any color you like. You can do that by going to the settings of this tweak here you have the color picker, you go here and pick any color you want and then just respring your device to apply it to your control center. Volume percentage. This tweak shows you exactly the percentage of the volume on your device. You can see here on the hood of my device whenever I turn up or down the volume it will show me the percentage of the volume. Magic labels allows you to customize each label with different color. So you can see the notes app has a green label, the music has a purple label and you can do that by going to the settings of this tweak, here you have colors from 1 up to 8, you go here, you pick a color and then here you enter the name of the app that you want to have that color on the label. NC color gives you the ability to change the color of the notification center, as you can see I have a green notification center and you can change the color by jumping to the settings of this tweak. First off, enable it right here, then pick any color you want and then just respring your device. Safari Refresher. This tweak allows you to easily refresh a page on Safari simply by pulling it down like this. Status Bar Color. This tweak allows you to change the color of the background of the status bar and also the color of the text and the icons on the status bar. To do that you need to go to the settings of this tweak and here is where you can change the colors for your springboard and also for the lock screen. Swipe to delete contact. This is a very useful tweak which allows us to easily delete contacts simply by swiping on them and then here it shows a delete button so you can easily delete any of your contacts. Tinge allows us to colorize the switches on iOS. As you can see here you can set a custom color or you can choose from pre-made colors right here. You can change the color of the switches and you can change both the way they look when they are on and when they are off. Universal Mute. When you turn on the mute switch on your device right here, this tweak will mute completely all the sounds on your device, even the media sound, as you can hear right here. You can see, when I turn on the mute switch, it will turn off all the sounds on my device. Unlock Volume. This tweak allows you to adjust the volume of your device from the lock screen. As you can see, I'm on the lock screen and I still can adjust the volume of my device. Vibrant CC. This is a simple tweak for the control center and what it does is that it will make it more colorful and a bit brighter. I don't know if you can notice this from the stock, but it looks much better like this. When you install it, you will see the difference between the stock control center and the control center with Vibrant CC. Classic Shooter Animation is a tweak for your camera app which will bring back the old shooter animation to the iOS 9 devices. Dock Color allows you to change the color of the background of your dock. So to do that you need to go to settings, go to this tweak, enable it and then here you have the colors. You can pick any color you want and then respring your device for the changes to take effect. Flasharama. This tweak enables the flash on the panorama picture so when you're taking a panorama picture with the camera app 
you will be able to turn on the flashlight. Flash ring. This tweak allows you to use the mute switch as a button to turn on and off the flashlight of your device. Icon renamer. This tweak allows you to rename any of your apps. Pretty simple to do, you just go to wiggle mode, tap an app or double tap it and then you can go ahead and rename that app. As you can see here, you can enter any name and apply it as the name of that app. AS blur allows you to blur the app cards on the app switcher. So you can see the settings app is not blurred, but Cydia is blurred on the app switcher. You can't see a preview of the app. So if you go to the settings of this tweak, you will have a list of all your apps and you can go ahead and enable any of them right here. Keyboard vibrate 8. This tweak adds a vibration to the keys on the keyboard when you tap them. I don't know if you can hear it from the camera, but it will add a nice little vibration whenever you tap a key on the keyboard. Marquee. This is a tweak for your folders. You can see how the title of the folder is sliding like this. So if you have a long title on your folder, it will show it like this scrolling. Minute time. This tweak customizes the look of your lock screen. So you will have the time right here and the date and the day right here. You can also change their colors and you can also use different styles. To do that, you go to the settings of this tweak and here you have simple style and you have MIUI UI style. You can choose that and then here you can customize these styles. You can go here to enable colors and you can choose any color you want and you can also change the date format and also the font style and the font size with these sliders right here. Alarm volume. This tweak allows you to change the volume of your alarms. You can do that with the slider right here under the settings of this tweak. You can also enable a fade in for the volume of the alarms. Red notification grabber. You can see right here the grabber of the notification center on the lock screen of my device is red which means that I have padding notifications. This is what this tweak does, it will make the grabber red when you have notifications on the notification sender. Invert respring. This tweak will change the colors on the respring screen so normally this would be all black and the logo, the Apple logo would be white. But this tweak will change it so if you have a white iPhone it will, you will have a black screen and a white logo. By shooter sound. This is a simple tweak, all it does is that it will disable the shooter sound from the camera app. Blurry badges. This tweak replaces the stock red badges of iOS with blurred badges as you can see right here. Also the color of the badge will match the color of the icon of that app. Folder icon save. This tweak allows to protect your folders. As you can see here I cannot enter this folder. Also, if I enter this folder, I wouldn't be able to delete any of the apps because they are protected by this tweak, which is called folder icon save. And here are the settings of this tweak. You can enable here all the three features of this tweak and then respring your device for the changes to take effect. CC tools. You can see here on the control center of my device, the quick launch icons are circles. And this is courtesy to this tweak called CC tools, which pretty much allows us to hide anything on your control center and also customize different stuff on the settings of this tweak you have all these enable buttons which allows you to customize the control center of your device. Roman passcode. This tweak will switch the normal numbers to Roman numbers on the passcode view on your lock screen and it looks pretty awesome. CC settings. A very useful tweak which allows you to add more toggles to the control center of your device. You can also rearrange them or remove any of them and you can do all that from the settings of this tweak. Here you have all the toggles. You can rearrange them like this or just slide them down here to remove any of them from the control center. Rounded dock. This is a simple tweak for your dock which will give the dock rounded corners and it looks very awesome. You can see it looks much cleaner than the stock dock on iOS 9. Roundification. This tweak will add rounded corners to iOS 9. As you can see here on the notification center, also on the control center and on the alerts, they look pretty awesome. Cylinder. This is a free alternative 
to barrel and it gives you these awesome animations when you swipe through the pages on your home screen if you go to the settings of this tweak you have effects and here's where you can pick different effects you can also pick more than one effect and create different formulas cc background this tweak allows you to set any of your images as the background of your control center to do that you need to go to the settings of this tweak first of all enable it right here and then go to select image it will send you to your photo library and you can pick any of your images then click done it will respring your device and it will set that image as the background of your control center insta better this tweak will add some cool new features to the instagram app for example you can tap and hold on a picture and then you can zoom in and out on that picture which is pretty awesome you can also save media from instagram to your camera roll and it also has a bunch of other cool features safari tab count when you're on safari this tweak shows you here how many tabs you have opened in safari lock screen tool this tweak gives you a lot of options to customize the lock screen of your device you can change the slide on lock text you can hide stuff like grabbers you can hide time date you can also change the color of the time right here just go here and pick any color that you like spot white this tweak will add this nice light blur to the spotlight search of your device now normally this would be way darker but with this tweak it will have this nice light blur status bar timer whenever you start the timer on ios this tweak will show you the timer on the status bar so when you're out of the clock app you will always see the timer on the status bar here near the clock you will have the timer which is pretty awesome and very useful grabber app 8 this tweak adds another grabber on the lock screen of your device so you have the camera here and you can have another app on the other side to do that you need to go to the settings of this tweak and then just go here to the left grabber and choose any application you want you can also change the camera grabber to any other application that you want hide settings search is a simple tweak which removes the search bar from the settings app if you don't use it or you don't need it and you want to get rid of it you can install this tweak and it will remove it from the settings app switcher flipper this is a tweak for your app switcher and it will change the direction of the app cards on the app switcher as you can see they will be on the opposite side of the app switcher custom notification sound when you go to your notifications you can go ahead and set a custom sound for any of your notifications just go to a notification here you have custom sound and here you can enable it and then you can pick any of these sound and set it as the sound of that notification for that app hood dismiss allows you to quickly dismiss the volume hood simply by tapping it as you can see it might sometimes be annoying because it takes a long time to go away but with this tweak you just tap it and it goes away transparent dock this is a simple tweak which completely removes the background of the dock nice clear dock without a background and it doesn't have any options to configure delete cut this tweak allows you to easily delete words simply by tapping and holding the shift button you can see here the back button will turn red and when i tap it it will completely delete the complete word so that's it for this video guys i hope you guys enjoyed it more awesome videos are coming so make sure you subscribe and don't miss any of them also go ahead and follow me on my social media you will find the links in the description of this video